The Melody Lounge on Coast FM 963. And with me here in the studio... Oh, hold on. One moment. I just need some background music for this. Yeah, that's it. That works perfectly. Ladies and gentlemen, here in the studio with us tonight on Melody Lounge, we have with us one of the Central Coast up-and-coming rappers of the time. Would everyone please welcome Muggsy Brady here into the studio. Welcome, Muggsy. How you doing? One moment. Just let me try this. Try again. Yeah, good, mate. Yourself? I'm swell, thank you. And uh, did you have did you have any trouble getting here at all? Actually, no, because I've got my license and stuff, which is all good. You know, drive the Mercedes 1995 C180, so it's a cruisy car, you know? I hate you so much. <laughs> anyway, uh, that, that's irrelevant why we brought you here today. Obviously, you've been doing pretty well. You've gotten your name out there in, in the hood and all the streets and all the ghettos of the Central Coast. So where exactly did you start? Back in school, actually, you know, um, like, pretty much I had no career path. So, you know, I always loved the culture of hip-hop and stuff. So back in school, you know, a lot of bullying and stuff like that. Oh, obviously, in high schools, you do. So obviously, the hip-hop was a, an escape to, you know, not be involved in that sort of atmosphere, like getting picked on and sort of thing. And um, after that, I made an album, went down to Sydney, and then um, it's been a success to people around the coast ever since. That's, that's an amazing story. Uh, whereabouts are you represented? For example, uh, there's a lot of suburbs on the Central Coast that many people would say, representing Gosford, yo, from the peninsula. Where, where is Muggsy originally from? Um, originally from, uh, I'd say Copa, Copacabana, but um, I wouldn't represent just one place. I'm pretty much representing all of the Central Coast. And, um, building... and, we, and we appreciate that, by the way. Yeah, thank you. And... Uh, building my name more out there and then move my way down to Sydney and, you know, more all around Australia, really? Well, you're getting pretty close. I mean, there was there's a lot of word of mouth. There's a lot of Muggsy buzz going around the place, what with your YouTube, which, by the way, feel free to plug. Oh, shibby, yeah. Exactly. What's what's the address to go to see YouTube other than search Muggsy on the search bar? Oh, it's just Muggsy187, really. And then if they just type in that, you can see... Um, my live videos from a concert last year, last month, not last year, and uh, just a couple of my, you know, songs. It's not music videos; it's just a picture of my album, and then you know my song in the background. If they want it, if they haven't heard my music. And speaking of this said album, you actually did recently spend some time down in Sydney to get this debut album of yours recorded, which ended up materialising and which became the album known as Ride or Die. Yeah. And there are fifteen. 15 fun tracks on the album, of course, stuff like King of the Underground, Ride or Die, and a few of my personal favourites, there was We Got the Sides, um, what, did, what were you thinking when you came up with that? Um, actually, with my first album, some songs, you know, tell about my background story and why I want to make it, and some songs are pretty much just fun, like, you know, to listen to and get a groove to sort of thing, so, you know, with We Got the Sides, I pretty much just... Oh, I didn't really have a background for it. I just thought, you know, this would be just a, a fun track for people in, like, a club or, you know, um, a gig or something to, like, dance to and that sort of thing. And obviously it's been a big hit to people who have listened to my album, really. Yeah, so there was We Got The Sides and another one, which was, and I think it's pretty easy to tell what this one was about, Can't Leave Rap Alone. That was pretty much just the one. I'm, I'm, oh, this is just me guessing. Obviously the title tells you, yeah. Yes, there's absolutely no bringing down any cultures whatsoever. Yeah. Also, being um, I sorry, I feel I have I should ask about this one. Um, as a, as a, well, it's been well discussed that you are indeed a rapper. Do you actually have? Do you, do you actually prefer? I know you obviously prefer rap over the other genres, but what other genres do you also like? Other genres, um, obviously hip hop. Um, but you know, I'd give rock. Um not really the new rock more the old um you know r and b a uh, bit of everything except um you know a bit of everything except for mainstream music you know the main stuff top forty yeah exactly so I wouldn't give that a chance <laughs> <laughs> yeah i can I can actually agree with you on this one uh next of uh, our uh, next question of all this album ride or die is there anywhere we can pick this up at the moment or are you still trying to secure a no, actually, um, just contact me on my Facebook, really. Um, just type in Muggsy or Muggsy Brady and then send me a message saying if you want my album, uh, you know, drop me a line and then I'll pretty much, 
you know, send you one or you can download my music for free on my music fan page, which is, you know, pretty easy to do, actually. Absolutely. And finally, our last question to you, Muggsy, is what's... What, what's next in what's next in Muggsy's world? Uh, is there any plans for a second album or any live shows coming your way? Actually, yeah, there is a live show at our King Cumber Youth Centre on the 22nd of this month, so hopefully I can get a lot of people coming down there. Um, my next album, I really don't have a date or anything. I need to, you know, get into a studio and, you know, make another one. But um, currently... Uh, my stuff is on Triple J Unearthed and uh, a company's picked it up and offered me to put an article of myself into the Drum Media magazine so that hopefully that'll be a big stepping stone to where I want to be. Absolutely. Well, yeah. ladies and gentlemen, this has been Muggsy Brady. If you like if you like what we're, the track that we're about to play for you all, don't forget to check out his fan page, facebook.com forward slash pages forward slash Muggsy and see what kind of music he's got for you. And here at Melody Lands, we're actually proud to be playing one of his tracks for you right now. This is one of the ones that we just mentioned. Please enjoy Muggsy's We Got The Sides. This is the Melody Lounge on Coast FM 963. Starting the weekend in style. Very amazing, very articulate Muggsy Brady with his song, We Got The Sides.